The Bible, though, teaches us what truth is. The Bible says that truth corresponds with reality at all times. The truth never changes, and it exists whether you recognize it or not. I can tell you that I sincerely don't believe in gravity and try to launch myself over the middle rows here, and you all know what's gonna happen. It exists even if I sincerely believe it doesn't. I can close my eyes as my four boys try to do and say, I don't believe gravity exists. And guess what? It still does. The Bible says that absolute truth is true for all people, at all times, in all places, and make no mistake, truth is not inclusive, it is always exclusive. Something cannot be true for you and false for someone else. Don't ever buy this lie. And yet culture attempts to deceive us into believing that truth is limited by time, that you know, truth is limited by your situation or your personal preference. You know what I think of when I hear this statement? I think of the great Wheaton professor, Arthur Holmes. He wrote a book, and I know that you know the title of this. The title of the book is, All Truth is God's Truth. And do you know what Holmes made sense of? Because God is truth, we'll get there in a moment, because all truth is God's truth, we can have a firm belief that any truth we find in the world can and will be reconciled with our faith. Tr the scales of truth, friends, the scales of absolute truth tip in our favor as a body of believers. <laughs>